Pretty bright, huh? Yeah. Nice pants. Appreciate it, appreciate it. Were you wearing the SpongeBob shoes earlier? Yeah, I was. This is my like SpongeBob type of day today. Is it? You know, one of my favorite uh, <laughs> seemed to, cartoons going up. Seemed to work out for you today. Talk about the difference between tonight and the other night and what was working for you. Uh, just my confidence. Uh, just, you know, I got in the gym. I went to the gym after the first game. Uh, you know, I, I was 0 for 5, so I had to get back in the gym and you know, get that stroke back. KB, talk to me. <laughs> but um, other than that, uh, just you know, playing hard at all times. You know, I took a lot of plays off the first game, and uh, you know, I just can't do that. My type of athleticism, I have to, you know, keep my foot in the gas at all times. Joel but Justice KP was saying that you were kind of a, uh, you're an active guy. How much is that going to play into how many minutes you get on the floor and, and how successful you are just being active? Uh, I mean, that plays in all the minutes I play on the floor because you know, some games my shots are not going to fall. You know, I got to do the other things. I got to, you know, got to rebound, deflect, deflect balls, and you know, run the floor. And that's what's going to keep me on the floor. What did KP tell you after that first game? KP? Uh -huh. uh, what everybody's been telling me, uh, you know, keep my head up, you know, keep working hard, uh, you know, good things going to happen. Seemed like you guys were a lot more physical tonight, uh, a little tougher than you were the other night. Did you kind of sense that? Yeah, uh, coach put emphasis on that in practice. Uh, a lot of box out drills, you know, um, bodies banging against each other. You know, we got number one team in the country coming up Tuesday, so, you know, we got some big guys in that team, so we got to be physical. I mean, that's my game. I've been shooting that since high school, so uh, I just had to translate that to the next level. And I mean, I'm pretty confident in that shot. Get these two games under your belt, exhibition games, but like you said, you got the number one team in the country coming up on Tuesday. What do you expect from that atmosphere in that game? Uh, I expect everything. Uh, it's probably one of the biggest games of the year for us and them. So we just got to go in that go in that game, you know, focus, and try to get the job done. How, how much of the guys, the older guys that are back this year, talked about the Duke game last year and kind of how it was a little bit of a humbling experience for them? And how do you guys kind of avoid that happening again? It's playing hard, you know, staying focused, you know, being humble, like you said. Uh, can't get too big-headed. You know, going to that game, like I said, they're number one team in the country, Final Four team. We got to go in there, be physical, and come out with a double. Coach Justice said that Nate's. Energy is infectious. Yeah. What, what does that mean in your world? Uh, Nate is always talking. You know, he's that guy who's gonna, you know, hold us together. He's like, he's like the glue to this team. He's gonna you know, communicate at all times. You know, you, <clears throat> shots not falling. He's gonna come up to you. You know, pat you on your butt and tell you, let's get, let's get going. Uh, he's that guy you, you want on your team. He's everything. Yeah. So, what kind of draw about trying to wanting to be aggressive and. Over. Said it was how, how do you draw a balance between being aggressive and over aggressive? Uh, just taking what the defense gives you and creating for others. I mean, I play with, we all play with great players. Everybody here can play. That's why we come here. So, you, know, you don't have a shot, give it up to your teammate. Your teammate will make that shot. How much, if any, of the guys from the back from last year talked about what happened in that new game the season for the guys and how to maybe get off to a different start this year? It's all about confidence. We want to see that game with confidence, that's all. Did you watch that game? The Duke game last year? Yeah. I think the whole world watched it. I'm sorry. The whole world probably watched it. <laughs> <laughs> what you, uh, what went through your mind when you saw something? Uh, just the guys were playing hard, you know. It wasn't, I feel like the guys were not focused. Uh, I mean, we just can't make that mistake again, that's all. How much? When was the last time before the first exhibition game that you had no points in the <laughs> yeah, I can't remember. Yeah, I can't remember. Were you pissed off? Were you just like hard to believe? Uh, you I mean, looked at that box score at the end. What did you What did you feel? Like I said, uh, my my game is based off athleticism and being active. You know, running the floor. You know, taking what the defense gives me. So uh, that game, uh, I wasn't really crashing the boards. Uh, I wasn't really locked in. Uh, I had to, you know, do some self-reflecting, and uh, that won't happen again. Is that one of the things you, obviously, everybody can have an off-shooting night, but when you look at the zero rebounds, is that where you really knew, like, yeah, I can, yeah, that's that, one thing I can control? Yeah, that's the, that's the thing I can control. Why do you think it happened that you weren't, you know, really? Wasn't being physical, you know, wasn't being physical on the board, that's about it.
Well, it's been a little bit of a slow start for EJ out there. What do you guys just send him to his confidence up? How do you expect him to go? Uh, EJ's going to get it going. Uh, he has to get it going. That's the guy we're looking for to have a big year for us. You know, we're going to go to him. He's going to make play for us. We talked about not being physical. How physical is this team? How would you assess where you guys are uh, as far as toughness? I feel like we're, we're very tough. Uh, in practice, we always put emphasis on being tough. Box out rebound, one-on-one -on -one box out rebound, five-on-five -on -five box out rebounding. Uh, we, sp we spend a lot of time on rebounding. Uh, Coach wanted us to be one of the toughest teams, uh, toughest rebounding team in the country, so that's what we had to do. How would you assess how much of a tune-up this was for Michigan State? Uh, I'll say these first two games has been a good tune-up. Just you know, seeing where everybody is, assessing everybody, uh, seeing how physical we are. You know, just not going against each other, but going against other teams. How much? Don't have as many big guys as you maybe ordinarily have. Uh, coach always yeah. tell us you know, three, four, five, crash the board every possession. <clears throat> that's what we got to do. What were some of the things that, that you guys cleaned up as far as rebounding? That, or some of the techniques that you did differently this time? Uh, just finding the people with the ball yeah, over there. You know, not just standing around waiting for somebody to hit you. You know, no matter where you at, find somebody to hit, and if the ball you know hits the floor. Somebody's gonna have to dive on it. Tell us, what do you think EJ is right now? EJ? With, with, with Nick being out and there's more pressure on him, what, what can you say about where his game is right now? Uh, EJ's doing great, in my opinion. Uh, you know, I feel like <clears throat> you know, God has been physical with him and he's taking what the defense give him. Uh, he just gotta, you know, keep running the floor hard and play hard on defense. It'll, it'll start falling. How do you think the team played tonight defensively? Defensively? defensively I felt yeah. like uh, we had a way better defensive game than the first game. You know, we put emphasis on getting out, closing out, uh, making them put the ball on the floor, and the shooter. Uh, like I said, defensive rebounding, you know, putting the, putting the body on somebody or grabbing the boards. It's being tougher, 